All right, hey guys. Well, I am Kristen Howerton. And I'm Claire Boyce. And we are two of the co-hosts of the podcast Selfie, which is all about self-care. And we are about to do something we've been wanting to do. For a which, long time. For a long time. Yes. Um, and we're going to, you know, sacrifice and do this very difficult yes. task of trying so hard. a million different CBD products. No children are home. While you watch us. <laughs> Well, okay. First of all, let's dispel any myths about CBD. Yes. Um, you can, C CBD does not necessarily have THC in it. Correct. So we're going to be doing two videos for you. The video that you are watching will be all CBD products with zero THC. Correct. Meaning, no high. Um, they are legal. Yes. <laughs> in every state. And they can be given to They can be given the to old, children. The yes. They can be given, we have a product for pets. Mm -hmm. Um and I mean, talk over, talk a bit about why you use CBD because I know you're an avid user. I, use it I am too. For everything, uh -huh. um, THC and non-THC. Right. Um, but for the non-THC, I have a house full of um, athletes who are getting hurt all the time, mm -hmm. and so we use a lot of bombs, a lot mm -hmm. of topical bombs, a lot of um, lotions with CBD in it, and then also um, almost all of my kids every day ingest CBD. All, yeah. all but one uh -huh. ingest. Um, helps with sleep helps with um, just like mm -hmm. overall vitality. Yep. And you know, some of us struggle with attention issues. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and so um, that helps a lot too. Yes. And so even my youngest son, he loves it. He yeah. has a taste for it. Like he really likes the taste of it. Yeah. And I don't even have to bother him about it anymore. He does it on his own. Yeah. And I have been using CBD for about three months. I have anxiety and insomnia. I find it to be incredibly helpful. Um, now, unlike Claire, and like I said, we're going to do a second video on, t on CBD products that also contain THC, which is the active kind of psychoactive ingredient. Yes. Unlike Claire, I don't like THC. Yeah. Um, some people with anxiety just don't do well with it. It makes so your anxiety worse, right? It actually does. Yes. It increases my anxiety and my insomnia. So um, we are going to do a separate video on THC, um, but this video is for those of you interested in CBD without any of that psychoactive stuff yes. going on. And we're going to show, we, the reason we did this as a video, um, as opposed to just as the podcast, yes. um, is that we really wanted to be able to show all of the different products. But there's so much out there too. There's it's really, so much out there. I mean, like being a consumer going to a store, you have no idea where to start. Right. And so hopefully after yeah. we finish this video, you'll have a little bit better idea yeah. of like some brands that you can trust mm -hmm. and that we've tried and either yep. loved or just thought were whatever. Okay. Well, let's start. We're going to start with skincare. Yes. Um, and then we're going to move up into, um, we're going to talk about oils. We're going to talk about, um, so we're going to talk about topicals and then we're going to talk about ingestibles um, where you're taking it, you know, kind of as a supplement. Yes. So, um, my glasses on. <laughs> At least you found them. Okay. You talk about this one. I'll talk about this one. Okay. So CBD body butter, big fan. Actually, I'm going to show another Any kind butter. of like lotion or topical mm -hmm. with CBD in it. Yes. I really love. I'm super vascular yeah. and my skin is either always inflamed, itchy, I'm having some kind of allergy. So mm -hmm. I use a product with CBD in all of my lotions and bombs. Yeah. Really helps me. This has a ton of CBD. This is 400 yeah. milligrams. Of Receptra is a really quality CBD um, company. There's a so lot 400 in milligrams too. is a, uh, you know, that is like a really good amount. Mm -hmm. You'll find varying um, strengths of CBD in different products. They should be putting it right on the front. Um, and that is a very generous amount of CBD in there. First of all, look how much is in here. Like you'd have to, yeah, it would take me a long time to use this. It's really, 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 really thick mm -hmm. um, and emollient and going into like the winter months where I'm already so dry and, yep. and cracking. I like this. So that's 400 milligrams. That's a pretty serious um, yes. strength. Here's another one. This is from Koi. Koi um, is a is a CBD product line that I really like. We're going to talk about one of their oils in a minute. They have CBD and THC products, mm -hmm. um, but this one, um, this healing balm is only 45 milligrams. So this one's a little lighter, but this is a really thick balm. Yes. Um, so if you have like I do eczema um, or any other other types of skin issues, this is a really emollient balm yes. for that. Um, and I actually use this one a lot. And the smell, it's like a kind Feels of a really menthol good. smell. It's like the a really faint, faint, like Tiger Balm almost. Yes. I really like this too. Great for elbows. All right, let's talk about face products. This is, my fa this is my favorite. Okay, you love that one, so you I talk do. about that one. Okay, so a few months ago, we interviewed um, Bridget and Lee from uh, King Harvest, mm -hmm. and they are a um, local company to us, and they had been doing their tinctures, and they had also been doing their flower, mm -hmm. and had been asked to do a skincare line. Yeah. And they created an incredible CBD oil. I use this every single day. I'm obsessed with it. I use it in my shampoo and my conditioner mm -hmm. as well. 
Um, I do get really loyal to products. You do. Until, you love them. until I find something else that I really yeah. love. It's like, I will use this forever until I don't. Yeah. Um, but it has jojoba in it. It has avocado oil in it. And I actually am um, prone to breaking out. Yeah. And I don't have that experience yeah. at all. And I used this after I microneedled. Ooh, So right yes. after I did microneedling, I uh -huh. used it like... I can't even believe how much faster I recovered using this that time. Mm -hmm. I believe it. So I love that. There's also another product that's similar. Well, okay. This one is um, Sol, S-O-L, stands for Strains of Life. They, um, again, are a very um, well-rounded CBD brand. Mm -hmm. They have a lot of different products. But this one is Collagen Retinol Revitalizing Cream. So if you are a retinol fan like oh, I snap. am, I did not know that. you've got CBD and retinol in one product. Yes. So this is more of like your nighttime serum, but they also have a really nice toner. I like that because that's, I get into, I get confused a little bit and I went to school, I'm an esthetician guys, and I you still get this. confused. When do you do the retinol versus the CBD? Because it's like you do the right. CBD first and then it's right. the retinol. This is really nice. So that you, do, you don't, you just use one product. Yeah. Yeah. So that's, that's also strains of life. That's a toner. God, this smells incredible. It this does. smells like you're at a day spa and someone just yep. brought you like cucumber water. Okay, speaking of smelling incredible, this is my very favorite CBD, CBD bath bombs. That is like the gift this year, I this feel like. This is the gift. In fact, I just want to give this to everyone I know. It's plant-based. This one's 50 milligrams. Oh, um, that's a good bath. Yeah, right? That's a nice bath This time. is from a brand called Life Elements. It smells really good. Um, and they're it's so cute. Broad spectrum hemp derived CBD. Yeah, super cute. And like in the front, I keep, there's like a little, a little bit of a flower. Of lavender. Yeah. yeah, so that's a nice one. And then some other fun smelling products. Um, I like these. these are, they kind of remind yeah. me of like, you know, the essential oil companies. They have like the roller yes. balls for like different things. So these have a little bit of CBD in them, um, but even if they didn't, I just really like them. This one's called Go With The Flow, and it's just a roll on. Um, this one is supposed to be for when you have your period, so. Oh, you nice. Know, um, you need all the help we can get. It just, I don't know, it smells like a spa. I don't know how to describe it. I like it. that one. This yeah. one is a little bit more intense. It's the Get A Grip. Well, is that the blue one? Yes. Yes, yeah, so this one has blue tansy in it. Oh, that's which, really good for the face, actually. It is, yeah, it's really good for your skin. Yeah, when I put it on, you can actually kind of like see. It's a little bit dark. And this company's called Plant Juice, so all of their stuff has like a little bit of CBD in it. Um, and then all of their stuff, they have a bunch of different formulations you can get as a rollerball or as a spray. That I like. That's the so I love thing. this one. This one's called Chill Out. Um, and, you know, I just spray this on myself all day long. I've I already tried like, this on me twice today. I love it. I like it too. I love it so much. We're, it smells like a day spa in here, you it guys. It does. It's a very relaxing day spa. Okay. I think that's all on our... Um, like topical. Topical. Okay. So now we're going to talk about ingestibles, which we have a lot of. What's the word? Oil. Tincture. <laughs> there's, Tinc there's been a lot of discussion about how we say this word. Tincture. Is <laughs> how do you say it? I always thought it was tincture. Tincture? It I could don't know. be. I, don't know. I say tincture. Tincture. Okay. I always think I'm tincture. saying it wrong. Yeah. I don't know. Or oil drops. <laughs> oil drops. Mm -hmm. Okay. So oil is the preferred carrier method yes. for CBD. I don't actually know the science behind that. Do you? Why think, is it always oil? I think oil? that it might be because it's the easiest absorbed. Well, also, it's, it's um, yeah, because then it goes through your saliva instead of going through your stomach and bloodstream. And then also, I think, just getting absorbed into the skin, too. Yeah, I don't know. We don't know the science, We can guys, Google that later. But we're just going to talk about all these different ones. Okay, so we have a number I'm of different brands. I'm interested in this one. So Koi is a really, really good brand. They um, are well-known. Um, this is one of their um, oils or tinctures. So the way that you use a tincture is that you would fill the dropper up. Um, now your measurements on CBD, that's a personal thing and you're going to have to try different things. Mm -hmm. So you're measuring not only how many milligrams are in a serving, but then how much you're serving yourself, Each time. if that makes sense. So Koi, um, has a lot of different, um, milligram like mm -hmm. increments, but this one's a thousand, which is pretty generous. And I think there was another one that was 500. Mm -hmm. So that is, that's a probably one. Well, of actually highest. let's look at all the ones we have. Cause I'm actually kind of curious, like what's what. I feel like a thousand um, was the top of the. I think you're right, and I'm some nervous. of them don't say it quite as clearly. I feel like when you're this seeing one's that, five, these are five hundred. So is the Foria. This one's a thousand. I feel like when they don't say how much is in there, it's not as good of a it, brand. I yeah, like, like it's too. almost it's like not. Um, I actually, totally agree. Like you know when you go to the store or like Ross or Marshalls and there's like yes. the essential oils in that yes. area, they're not really essential oils. Totally. So I feel like it's in that realm. 
Okay, so the two, of all the tinctures we have, the two that are 1,000 milligrams are Feels. Which you've talked about before, Which I've I talked love. about before and I like, and Koi. So I'm gonna do a tiny little taste test of this one. What is so, the flavor? Orange. I think that, yeah, this one's flavored. So you can get CBD oil flavored or not flavored. I personally think CBD oil tastes kind of nasty. Yeah. It tastes like marijuana smells. If anyone remembers being in college and accidentally drinking like the bong water or like the like roach drink, <laughs> like do you know what I'm talking about? Yeah. That's well, I never did like. that, but yes, I would imagine. Oh, it well, at least like one that. time. No, I actually didn't. <laughs> um, but did okay, so I'm gonna try this one for us. Okay. Oh. Oh, is it good? You know what? Having a little flavor makes a huge difference. I think so. Because that's good. That's actually There was good. one try that, you should try okay. this one. There it was one like that I saw, it was like strawberry milkshake too, that they have koi. Oh, super smart. And again, these do not have THC in them. No one's getting high. They're not being marketed to children. This is really flavors. good. Yeah. It, it is tastes really kind of like a creamsicle. It does. Feels is also oh. a really nice brand. And one thing I like about Feels, um, if you're interested in trying CBD, is they, they have this thing that's called a flight where you can order three different strengths of CBD. So smart. And try it all at once. Now, I just tested that. I taste tested it with a tiny little drop, but I would recommend if you're trying CBD, I would recommend starting with 500 milligrams. So again, with this one, then you'd fill it to halfway up yes. to get 500. Um, and some of them have, I don't know if the Koi did, but some of them have like markers on them. They do. So that you can, you can kind In of fact, see it. I'll show you one that has the markers on it. I think, I think this one does. Yeah, for you, yes. it, you can see how much it's kind of like a baby medicine dropper. Exactly. So let me talk about this company too. I, I really like Foria um, products a lot. This is their tonic. They call it a tonic, but it's 500 milligrams. Um, and again, it's, you know, you just want to make sure that it's broad spectrum mm -hmm. CBD, that it's tested, that you know exactly what you're getting. The testing is really important. The testing is really important. There's a lot of brands where like feels their stuff comes with um, a QR code, and so you can look at that exact batch and the testing that was done on that exact batch. And I think state to state regulation is different. Yes. But a lot of companies, especially companies that I've used that I trust, on their website, you can go to their website and they'll be fully transparent with all their, te they'll have tested everything. Yeah. And they'll list the toxicity amount yes. for every. Yes. So making sure that they're being transparent, that's kind of will give you the go ahead to try the product. I think Foria personally is a nice product, a starter product for beginners. It's a very light oil. You can see um, it doesn't have as much of a taste. Is it mixed watery. with essential oil? I don't know. You know, the MCT. Oh, MCT oil. Which, okay. is, similar. which is what Feels does as yes. well, which that's supposed to have some synergistic like, but that one's really light. Don't you think that one doesn't have as much flavor? Not as, as much. And it kind of would be something I would like take at night. Maybe yeah. it's like a nighttime taste. I feel like that too. I don't know if that's what's a thing, but okay. This is an oil, but this is actually not for humans. This is for pets. <laughs> it's called hemp's pets. CBD oil drops I have for heard your pets. Incredible things about people giving their animals CBD I have drops. Too. Yeah. I don't know. I'm not one of those people, but no. okay. So these two products are from a company called CBD essence and they also have, um, flavored mouth drops. So they have these, this one's not, but they have um, a cinnamon flavor. Okay. And it's, it's very, you know, again, very similar um, sublingual. Um, although this one is not This, this is 600 milligrams. Oh, 600 milligrams. Yeah. So that's a nice in-between. But this one is interesting. It's, it's a lot darker than the others. And you're going to see different like variations. Yeah. Um, I'm gonna try this one. And it depends on where the CBD is derived from too. Hemp mm -hmm. versus cannabis flower. So you're going to see oh, variations in the color too. This one has a little bit of a, like a sweet flavoring in it too. Let me see. That's well, nice. That's smart that they give. Yes. Because sometimes, and again, like it depends on the batching mm -hmm. of the batches, but sometimes you can get a very, very earthy. That's pretty earthy mouthful. though, I will say. That's, okay. It has this little sweetness to it, but it, it definitely tastes like weed. <laughs> you sh it sure does, but it yeah. is sweet. It is, It kind of right? tastes like a wheatgrass shot. It really does taste mm -hmm. like a wheatgrass shot. Okay, I like this um, this company. It's called mm -hmm. Movement Lesson because they have different. Ooh, nice catch. Um, they have different formulations for different things: rest, control, relief. I also like their packaging. Oh, I yeah, it's super cute. And so um, theirs is CBD with with an essential oil. It's 500 milligram tinctures. Um, but it has essential oils that are mm -hmm. supposed to partner for whatever it is the issue that you're dealing with. So I feel like a lot of people when they these. first start, mm -hmm. they start with these with the essential oil mix. I think so too. A girlfriend of ours that was kind of like how she chipped her toe in the her toe mm -hmm. in the water with these. Oh, and this one's nice because the the dropper also has the like 
you know, the measuring. Now I'm just putting little drops in my mouth because I don't want to like- She's not doing like full squeezes. Uh -uh. These have a carrier oil of MCT also. That's nice. Is it like lavender? Mm, I don't know. I don't know that it's lavender, but it tastes a little spot -ish. These have the QR codes too. Yeah. Is that what you're yeah. saying? This is the brand? Yeah. Nice. And Feels does that one as well. This one is Movement Lesson. Rest. Okay. And man, it's, it's hard to beat that koi. I have it was to, really I, good. I, I, I'm going to say taste-wise, the koi wow. is winning. It really is. The koi like, it makes me want more flavor. of it. I know. You do. I, I mean, I have to say... CBD oil does not taste the best. No. I, I think it's smart to have like some kind of a- I do of... know some people though who like really love it and like crave it. I do too, but I also know people who can't tolerate the oil at all. So Correct. we're gonna talk about other ways to ingest yes. CBD. One, um, which is super obvious is soft gels. Um, this is, these are from CBD, CB Distillery, which is a really, um, really good brand. Mm -hmm. This is only 30 milligrams, so it's not a ton. I, to me, this is the best way to give to children. Absolutely. Um, so, you know, it's just a nice little soft no flavor. gel. Yeah, and you can get these in different strengths. So I think that's a good way to take CBD. Now I have to say another way, and this is from the same company, CB Distillery is gummies. I like those. They're really a lot. good. Mm -hmm. They're really good. Um, this particular one um, is for nighttime, and so it has a little bit of um, melatonin. melatonin in it. But they also have, um, same brand, CB Distillery does them without the melatonin. Mm -hmm. To me, this is a really nice way to take them. I mean, you'd want to keep them away from your kids because they're good. Or not. Yeah. <laughs> well. Take a little rest, to me. Yes, I know, right? Um, but no, those taste, those taste really good. And yeah. I've tried other ones that they kind of taste just like like grass with sugar on top. Yes. Those are actually. These actually taste yeah. like gummies. You would not know. Um, here's another I'm option. About this. this is Green Grove, and this um, what they've done is they've packaged it in a drink, but it has caffeine in it too. So it's kind of like an energy drink with CBD. So this has 75 milligrams of caffeine and 12.5 milligrams of CBD, and you just add it to water. Very smart. Yeah, like a little drink. Um, and then there are, you know, similar to marijuana, there are ways that you can smoke CBD. Which um, I'll be honest with you, I can't quite wrap my mind around that. It's different. I know it's weird to, mm -hmm. to, to consider that you would smoke marijuana without the psychoactive So it's like you're ingredient. going through all of, like the work of like hiding it, one, <laughs> finding a lighter, because who the frick has a lighter I these days? Know. And then the smell, because it's still going to smell, right? Oh, well, let me, I mean, let me let you smell this. So this is from... Um, Island, but um, Island Premiums. Who also has the cutest packaging ever. Oh my gosh, seriously, super cute packaging. Mm -hmm. And they have a number of different products. Um, but this is Island Flower CBD. It's, it's their strain is called Jellyfish. Okay. It has 0.15% of THC. Okay. So really, really low. Yes. Um, but take a look at this. I mean, it's just full on bud. Just full, just full on, on bud. bud. So, you know, you're going to roll that like you would roll a joint, but there is no THC in it. I just don't, I don't know. I, I'm with you. Yeah. I mean, maybe there is some kind of body relaxation. I, I will say this. I will say this. If you were a person who was addicted to just smoking, and in fact, let, yes. me, show you, let me show you this next product. So this is also from Island Premiums. Oh, this so is these brilliant. These are their pre-rolled. These are basically CBD cigarettes. This to me is brilliant for someone. I mean, like I have some family members who are just completely addicted to cigarettes. Yeah. And I've tried to get them to switch over to vape pens, yeah. which we're finding are not that much better. These anyway. look exactly like a cigarette. They look exactly like a cigarette and it's just CBD. There's no... Um, so if you have that physical habit, uh -huh. you know where it's like you have yeah. ritual, there is no nicotine in this. Um, yeah. So anyway, and this is that same strain. It's called jellyfish. So it's very, very low yeah. legal level of THC, I believe. So yeah, um, there's those. I can, I can think of a couple people that would love that for Christmas. Yeah. I mean, <laughs> I have not tried these because I'm an asthmatic, so I don't do. Right. And I don't what also confuses me a little bit, is there a filter on there? Yeah. Look. Interesting. Like, so it really it's, is. It really is just like a cigarette. Yeah. See? Filter to there. Very yeah. cool. And then um, another option is um, you can get CBD in a vape pen. Yes. So this is um, the company called Foria. They are one that I really like. They have this like nice light tincture, but this is an option too where this again, and I know everyone's kind of like, what the heck with vape pens, mm. but this does not have nicotine and does Correct. not have THC. Correct. This is completely legal and it is just simply CBD oil. And I think this is one of the first ones you tried. 
it's the only one I've ever tried. Okay. Yeah, it's the only one I've ever tried. So, and you can see it's just like a thick little viscous oil in there. And then, I don't know, should I try it on yes, camera? Yes, you Do I want to vape on camera? I feel like a teenager right now. But again, it. there's no THC in this. No THC. So, it's essentially essential oil. It's really it what is, it's yeah. Like. I mean, so, you know, when you, when you draw it in, you just kind of puff. And it's the fastest way for you to get yeah. any kind of relief. Yeah. And it tastes kind of like, have you tried this one? Mm -mm. It tastes a little bit like vanilla. Um, it's really pleasurable. Mm -hmm. It kind of like allspice. Yes. Yeah. But yeah, I would definitely say if you have a loved one who is addicted to vaping or cigarettes, mm -hmm. this would be a very nice because kind of I really, leading off yeah, situation. I really do think so much about smoking is part of the ritual. I agree. You know, I like the whole... Agree. The whole deal. And so I just want to point out too, I mean, Claire and I have ingested quite a bit of CBD. Yes. There's, you know, you don't feel anything. No. I mean, if it's, if CBD is working, you don't feel anything. And we'll make jokes about people being relaxed or taking naps, but really you feel nothing. No. You shouldn't feel anything. You shouldn't to feel... To the point where it's almost disappointing if this is. is not what you were hoping for. Right. I mean, I had a friend who tried something with me and then like 30 minutes later, they're like, well, I don't feel anything. I'm like, you're not you, supposed you to. You don't feel anything. And the idea is that over time it builds up in your yes. body and then... That's right. You're having the healing from, you know, the inside yeah. out. Yeah. So yeah, a number of different products. All of them, all of the ones that we've spoken about today are very reputable companies. Yes. Um, Transparent and will, with their testing. Yes. Again, I can't mm -hmm. stress that enough, making sure that they're testing their products. Yep. So we will link all of those up on selfiepodcast.com. Um, we are constantly talking about CBD products on Selfie, um, which is the podcast on... I feel like it comes up every week. It really does. Really organically, too. So if you've never seen our podcast, you can find us on Apple Podcasts. Yes. And then we welcome you to watch our next video, which is going to be delving into all of the THC included. <laughs> My show. Um, CBD products. <laughs>